We're here at the University of Mary Hardin Baylor to speak to George and Penny Hogan. We are really excited. Uh, we are going to have the opportunity to do a benefit concert for uh, TSO, which is Temple Symphony Orchestra, which is a really gem, wouldn't you say, a little gem of, a, of an orchestra here in Central Texas. Some of the singers that we're singing with, uh, uh, Terry Johnson, uh, we have not had the opportunity to sing with her, so we're very excited about that. Right. Lee Ping, we haven't um, sung with her. Um, and we're looking forward to meeting her. Um, I guess actually, we'll meet we her. Even met her? <laughs> no. We haven't even met her. We haven't. Um, we, uh, we sent, or I sent PDFs of all the music off to uh, Lee Pink so she can be rehearsing. So it's almost like this whole satellite uh, rehearsing going on. We'll have a dress rehearsal next Friday uh, and fun then fun do the show Saturday. Yeah. Uh, Tom Fairley been so kind to us over the years. And uh, yes. uh, the four of us wanted, well, actually the five of us wanted to, uh, pay that back to the community and to our mm -hmm. symphony. Yeah. You know, a lot of people don't realize that the symphony, uh, the only funding that comes to many of those organizations are from public donors mm -hmm. uh, and ticket goers. But oftentimes concerts are not, um, the cost, the overhead uh, of those organizations are not covered just through ticket sales. We'll open with something that, you know, all four of us can come and, you know, can come out and sing and have fun with. I believe it's a grand night for singing. So it won't be a lecture recital that's oftentimes stiff uh, and academic. Um, it, it really, I think, you'll be afforded to kind of enter into the world of the uh, artist and uh, really have a, a, a wonderful relationship uh, within that hour. Yeah. At the University of Mary Hardin Baylor, I'm Steve Pettit for the Colleen Daily Herald.